Alrighty, what's going on guys? Linky1029 here, and welcome back to another episode of the Purge SMP server, guys. So, in the previous episode of the Purge, if you guys were not keeping track, we began our amazing adventure on the Purge Season 2. And I just, I really want to thank you guys for the amazing support. In the previous episode, we reached the like goal of 30 likes, which is absolutely amazing. And like I said in that video, if we reach 30 likes, I'll go and I'll record another Purge episode for you guys. So that is what I'm doing today. The next thing is in an hour of the purge episode one being up we reached a hundred views already so honestly just thank you guys so much for the amazing support on purge for season two already and i would love to see the support continue into the second episode so we have a lot planned for today's episode but i wanted to start at what is going to be spawn because our good buddy dj dj megatron has set up <clears throat> uh has set, i'm calling it just a dinner i apologize DJ has gone ahead and set up a donation spot. So basically, he's going to be, for now, mainly heading up the building of the center of spawn. So he's looking for stone. So if any purge members are watching this, he's looking for smooth stone. So if you guys want to go ahead and donate that to him, that would be very good. Because he has, in, um, in the purge Skype chat... He has shown us some pictures of what he's, what he's hoping to do for Season 2 spawn. And it looks amazing so i'm very excited to see how he can pull this off he's an amazing builder in my opinion i've seen some of his other stuff in his survival let's play and everything so he's pretty good and i think he'll be able to make spawn look really awesome uh xenox is on right now trident was on a bit ago so was relics all those sort of people so that's pretty cool uh updates on the sheep farm which was our base in the previous episode uh it's still going i'm still working at it but i've basically moved most of my stuff out because also gotten some more stuff since the previous episode uh, i'm recording this the day that um episode one went out so i'm recording this on monday because the episode at 30 likes also i will say one thing if we can reach 30 likes again on today's episode of purge i will get another episode out for you guys this weekend i'm not going to do it tomorrow like i did with this one this is just because it's the beginning of season two and i want to make the episodes like i want to make people get excited for the series and everything but that's the only reason why i'm doing this uh just this but if we reach 30 likes again i will definitely i promise you guys i will put out another episode of purge for you guys this weekend and then after this weekend after hype season one week is out uh we will go back to normal scheduled videos so that's pretty cool those are basically the updates that i wanted to give it spawn um also in the next episode uh me ha not harry me fluffy relics and sharky are going to be doing an epic caving session so look forward to that in the next episode guys uh we're recording it tomorrow and look so look forward to that it'll be pretty cool and yeah, uh, so in the next clip, guys, uh, I'm basically going to be showing you guys a few different locations, uh, a few different areas that I had in mind to build my base, uh, so my, like my first settlement on the server. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. So this is the first location that I've decided to think of as a base. So basically, it's surrounded on water on three sides, also a desert over there. So it's kind of like an outcropping mountain peninsula. Basically, what I had as an idea for sort of like a mountain home is basically a glass... Um, <clears throat> A glass flooring going all around the side of the mountain and then little entrances into the mountain that basically allow for storage, farms, uh, my bedroom, furnace room, crafting stations, all that sort of stuff, uh, animal rooms, horse stables, all that kind of stuff in the mountain. And basically the glass, uh, the glass walkways around it would be used for aesthetics and they would also be used to kind of like access the different points because one thing I'm not 100% sure about with this design is if the all the rooms inside are going to be connected via um via inside pathways or if they're all going to be connected through different entrances with the glass i feel if we use different entrances with the glass that it would it would make the glass much more useful and the paneling at least on this side of the building would maybe be like up here would be the glass paneling going all around the different during going all around the entire mountain and that was one of the ideas that i had for this build uh, another idea that i had for it was right here or maybe like some sort of waterfall that goes into the water and behind the waterfall would be sort of like a cavern and through that cavern we could access the rest of the base just something that involves kind of like a secret layer kind of entrance with like a waterfall cavern and i'll make a direct relation if you guys have ever seen the uh the movie the disney and pixar animated movie the incredibles basically in that movie on um on i forget his name of the supervillain um 
syndrome on syndrome's island he's got a waterfall where when these like these circular pods go into the waterfall the waterfall opens up in the middle and the sun, you can go through it and that is feasible if we have a waterfall like this for example and we push out a piston blocking the water source the water will part at that center spot and all the water will separate to the sides and then once that piston's pulled back in the water will go back down so that kind of idea is very much feasible in minecraft it's just based on if you guys want to see it as a build another idea that i had for this kind of range of mountains here is building an inland like like a ship port going in through here like this is a nice little ship port with a bunch of little cool uh, aesthetically designed ships and some houses and some buildings going all along the mountain and it could be like our own little town on the server and I think that would also be a pretty cool idea so those are three ideas that I had for houses slash kind of like our first big build which would be the town on the server and we could Heck, we could combine the ideas, and we could do both. We could build a town along this mountain range, and kind of have, like, the evil lair of the town, like, our home, be, like, right up here. I think that would be a pretty cool thing to have as well, but I want to get your opinions. So what I'm going to do is, for our base, I'm going to leave a straw poll link in the description, so you guys can go ahead and vote on which of the ideas you'd like the most. I'm not going to include the Pirate's Cove idea, because if we do, do, if we do build our house here in this location... I might also want to do the Pirate's Cove as sort of like an extra thing, just as like more stuff here to do on the on our base. Uh, so that would be an idea. So I'm not going to include that, but what I will include is a vote between the waterfall, the waterfall entrance into the mountain, or the glass panel walkways along outside of the mountain. And if you guys want to go ahead and vote on that straw poll, that would be very awesome and it would help me a lot to make up the decision. If you guys are too lazy to vote on a straw poll, yet you're not too lazy to leave a comment, you can also leave a comment leaving your opinions as well. Either one of those ways of getting in contact with me would be greatly appreciated because either way, I think I could get the best information out of you guys. Also, I am going to, uh, tonight, after I record this, after I edit this, after I get some homework done, because tomorrow I do have my first final, uh, it's a science lab practical, which is basically the part of the science final where you sort of do, like, experiments, and then you record your data and observations and all that stuff, so I've got that tomorrow, so I do have to go ahead and study for that in a little bit, and then after that I'll play a little bit more, and I'll get some stuff done, like, I'll get some diamond armor going, mine, maybe make an enchantment table, I can't go to the nether yet, because the purge people, all of us have decided that we're going to be doing the nether as a group event, also we're going to be doing the wither fight as a group event, and the ender dragons group events, so those are a bunch of group events that you guys are going to want to see. Also, we always have to think when we build our base, we need to have a secret vault. Now, usually when you play on servers, why would you want to have a secret vault? Well, it would be to keep people from stealing. But on most SMPs, that's just an aesthetically appeasing thing because on most SMPs, there's no time on the server where you're ever allowed to steal. But no, since this is Purge, on August 1st, I believe, we are having our first purge night, because it's every two months, uh, every first of every, every first of the month after two months before the previous purge night, or the beginning of purge, so it's going to be on August 1st, or around that first week, so having a vault to store our stuff once purge night comes around is going to be very important. What can we drop here? Uh, we can go ahead and drop gunpowder. I really don't need that. I'd rather have the coal right now, because we're just starting, so we really don't have that many resources. But those are a few of my ideas for the build. I really like this location here, and I will show you guys how close it is to spawn. It's within proximity. Now, we were told to not build that close to spawn, but I think we're a far enough distance as to where my stuff really won't interfere with spawn. But if you guys think it's too close to spawn, you can go ahead and tell me that as well. But if we run right over here, spawn is pretty much right here. So if I can, I'm also, while, after I finish getting diamonds and everything, before the next episode, I'm going to go out a little bit further in the world. I want to scout to see if there are any other mountains and coves, because that pirate's cove idea is also a pretty good one. I want to scout uh, out some more mountainous regions, and I want to see if there's any bigger mountains or larger mountains that would suit our needs better as an indoor base and everything. Because if we want to do my idea of having all the different types of farms and all the different types of uh, facilities, storage rooms, enchanting rooms, potion rooms, all that sort of stuff, farm animal rooms, horse stables, we're going to need a big mountain. And I don't know 100% if that mountain is going to be large enough for us. So I'll go ahead and I'll scout a little bit more, and I will see if, um, if we can find one also. If you guys want the seed, I do not have permission. I was going to give you guys the seed to the world. Can you do it through here? Don't know. I don't know if the seed is visible through there. But I will, I will, because I was going to say, if you guys wanted the seed, you could maybe try to help me out finding the um, the location and everything. But I don't think I can do that. So yeah, guys, I hope you all enjoyed the today's episode of the Purge SMP. 
If you did, please be sure to leave a comment down below. It would be very much appreciated. As always, uh, in the next episode, we're going to be doing an Abacaving event with Fluffy and Relics. Uh, there's also a ton of Sea Temples to conquer, so those are going to be, com be coming in the next few days. I don't know if we've decided on doing one Sea Temple as a group event and the other ones can just be got done as individual people. Haven't really looked into that that much. I'll probably ask in chat tonight. But you guys, I will get back to you guys on all that. So, 30 likes and, we and I'll release another purge this weekend, which is the Abacaving. If not, just wait till next week. We've already done two purges this week, which is what I like to do. Hope you all enjoyed, and as always, I have an LP. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.